Greetings, my name is Alex and today we will figure out how we can convert our cloud point scan which we will make this 3D scanner app to a full mesh so you can use it for 3D printing or other projects. For this we will use two free software. First is MeshLab. You can download and install the last version of this software for Windows, Mac or Linux if you use it. Second software is MeshMixer. Please download and install this free program as well for Windows or Mac. So let's start and make a new scan. Choose create new scan and tap on point cloud scan. I will scan my daughter's teddy bear. Finally, I finished scanning and got a good result. Let's set the out of the beer. Okay, now we need to send this scan to the computer. You can make it these two ways. First, choose your scan and download the link of this scan. After that, share with link with your computer. Link will open on computer and download your 3D scan file. Second way is to open the files app on your device and find the 3D scanner app folder. Here you can find all your scans. As our 3D scan on the computer, let's open MeshLab and drag and drop point cloud 3D scan file. Teddy Bears looks good, but still it is a cloud point and we need to make three simple steps to tune into the full mesh. First step, compute normals for point sets. Open filters after normals, curvatures and orientation after Compute normals for point sets. Let's set the default settings by pressing apply. Second step. Optimize your point clouds. Reduce the density of the point cloud by choosing filters, point set, point cloud simplifications. In the number of the samples, fill pick somewhere between 100 1000 quick, less detailed and 1 million. Slower, bigger but more detailed. Click apply to wait. You will now see two versions of your point cloud scan, the original and the reduced version. Last one step, convert the optimized point cloud to a mesh. Click to turn off the original point cloud, leaving just the optimized version on and select it. Then choose filters. Permission, Simplification and Reconstruction, Surface Reconstruction, Wall Pivoting. Accept the defaults and set it applied. Wait. It will take some time, but after it will be finished, you can see uh, your mesh. It is too poor quality, you could try again by optimizing the original point cloud with higher sample count.
When you are happy, you can save mesh with file export mesh as and choose uh, OBG type of file. Let's check how our scan looks now. Open any online 3D viewer and upload a new file. Now 3D scan looks very very good, but still have some defects like holes in mesh and unnecessary parts. Let's fix it in mesh mixer. Open Mesh Mixer and import our updated TDBF 3D object file. Prepare object and choose Edit and after that make solid. Here you can play with settings and other accept change. Now need to remove all unnecessary parts on this model. Choose analysis, inspector and apply after repair all. Press thing is to the left stand manually. Select brush and manually remove all unnecessary parts.
that is all. Our model is ready for 3D printing or using our your projects. Thanks for watching. Ask question in the comments and let me know what tutorials videos you would like to see.